Hey, Chad here with SpeedX, the fast growing gear site on the web, and today we're gonna uncrate the Z1R Saturn helmet. Before we jump in and give you the full rundown on the Z1R Saturn helmet, go ahead and subscribe. That helps keep bringing you the best gear reviews in the universe. And if at any point you decide you'd like to purchase a Z1R Saturn helmet from Speed Addicts, we would appreciate that. There's a link in the description below to shop for this guy or any other parts of gear you might need for your next two wheel adventure. So Z1R, they're one of our top selling budget friendly helmets today. The Z1R Solaris is their modular helmet and we sell more of those than any other modular helmet on the market. Now, when it comes to open face helmets, they have a couple different options. They have the Road Max, which is a little bit more of a modern design, or if you want kind of that classic look, they have the Saturn. So the Saturn is an open face with a drop down visor, it is DOT rated, it weighs two pounds, nine ounces. So it's nice and light, it's a polycarbonate shell, size is extra small through 2X. It does run true to size. Go by that C Z1R sizing chart at speedaddicts.com and you should be in good shape. But remember, if you buy your next helmet from Speedax, not only will you look cooler than all your riding buddies, but you get no cost return. So as long as the helmet's brand new in the original packaging and you live in the lower 48 states, a couple clicks, you get a free return label. You can exchange it, you can get a refund, whatever you need to do. Give us a shot on your next helmet purchase and we will treat you like family. So let's take a look at this Z1R Saturn classic helmet, three snap visor, uh, ready. These are not, no vi uh, snap visors are included. You can run whichever ones you want. These are kind of standard distance apart. You can purchase them from Z1R. You can get a little visor, you can get a bubble shield, whatever you want to run. You will get a smoked interior lens out of the box and it is actuated with your hand by just grabbing on it. You have tabs on either side and uh, nice and sturdy. <clears throat> I've had a lot of helmets when it comes to these drop down visors. Some of them, when you grab onto them, really just don't feel like they're gonna last long. This action here is nice and tight it, uh, and secure there. So you can bump that to get it up out of the way. No ventilation. It's a classic kind of spherical design without any sort of ventilation, but of course you are running an open face helmet. Primary point of entry for air is going to be here, 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 and here. These are, <laughs> these are your entry points. So uh, if you need more air, pop up your shield, get a little bit more air. That's how the ventilation works on this. On the back you do see is DOT rated. And this color in front of me is called the tan matte or matte tan. The choice is yours, kind of a unique colorway. Uh, you don't see a lot of uh, colors out there on the market like this, so kind of, a, kind of a cool one. Okay, let's flip this over and see what we're working with on the inside. It does have a removable washable liner and a classic double D ring entry point. So we're gonna pop this out and show you that the helmet is also comm system ready. So if you wanna run a comm system, you have speaker pockets, you will be able to attach any comm system right here with no problem on the left hand side because there's no actuators in the way that work this uh, drop down visor. This is just a manual style visor. So that makes life a little bit easy. So if you're running comm system, you'll be in good shape. Cheek pads, removable, washable. There they are. It's moisture wicking, uh, fast drying material there. <clears throat> and on the back, this liner plugs in to the very back of the helmet. And there it is. There are no ports because there's no ventilation system. So pretty straightforward EPS crush liner behind the comfort liner. The comfort liner is mesh. It's their same sort of wicking material there. So very straightforward helmet, classic design and look and uh, budget friendly. I forgot to mention the price. These start at about 70 and go up to $99. So that's what Z1R is all about. Very budget friendly, quality helmet. They're gonna back it up with a one year warranty from Z1R. Go over to speedax.com to check this out. You still got questions, don't worry. Speedax are standing by through email live chat and phone support. And as always, if you've got one of these, let us know how you like it in the comment section below, or you can just drop your questions down there and one of our team members will get back to you right away. Appreciate you for watching. We'll see you next time to find out what's in the crate.